G'day guys, I've seen a few uh, posts regarding some Pixel staying on uh, when using uh, Falcon smart receivers. So I've just experienced this here ourselves when we're just doing a quick test of our displays we're setting up. Um, as you can see on our rosary wreath here, I've got nothing else powered on. There's no, uh, we just got the smart receiver. Uh, it's got power to it. There's no data being sent out to it. Notice that we've got um, those few pixels at the start of a string lit up. Uh, what I found what's causing this is if we go over to our uh, web interface for our Falcon, I'm just going to try and open him up here, move that screen so we can see a little bit better. Uh, we've pushed our configuration out like we normally do. Uh, we know we've uploaded our, uploaded our inputs and we uploaded our outputs and it's sending our outputs out to our Falcon. So we can open up our web interface. We're running an F48 here. And it's the same if you're running F16 with uh, smart receivers. And we'll notice here, because this is on a port output, sorry, which doesn't have anything connected to it. But we have this one here, which is the B side of this output, is causing those few pixels to stay on. Now some people will probably jump in and say have you got all the dip switches etc. Um, correct, yes we do. So what we'll do is we actually need to add a pixel count to one. See to there, just change that to a one and we'll hit save. And now we've still got our little light just went off. You see that? It just went off. So if we change that to, so anyway, just a quick tip guys, um, if you've got um, some Falcon differential smart boards and you're getting a few pixels um, staying on at the start of that string, just open up your web interface and if there's anything that comes up a dummy, just um, type a, a one into it and hit the save button and you should be good to go. Alright guys.